This Louis XVI style commode was made by one of the most important Parisian cabinet makers of the 19th century, Henri Dasson. The commode represents the ultimate luxury in the art of cabinet making. It was first supplied by Jean-Henri Riesner for Marie Antoinette at the Chateau de Versailles. Perhaps the most striking feature of this commode is the painted central panel on the door. It's in the manner of Watteau and would have been commissioned by a specialist painter working in the French capital. Alongside the central panel are these exquisite floral trellis marquetry uh, panels, which are executed in costly timbers, including ashwood, as well as ebony and boxwood. We see similar trellis work in pieces of furniture at the Getty Villa in California, as well as the Rothschilds Wollaston Manor in England. Of an important size, this commode is surmounted by a serpentine and thumbnail molded edged Prèche d'Alep marble and would have been quarried in France. But perhaps the most defining feature of Henri Dasson's cabinet work is the fine ormolu mounts. Henri Dasson was trained as a sculptor before becoming a furniture maker in his own right, and the sharpness of the mercury fire gilt. Ormolu mounts is a defining feature of his work. Henry Dasson liked to sign his furniture, and we know from the signature on this particular commode that his craftsman would have worked about 4,000 hours to complete the commode in 1879. It's a practical as well as elegant piece of furniture and would be a wonderful addition to your home.